Look, I'm not saying that the idea of twin flame or soulmate isn't real, or that it doesn't exist, or it isn't true for some people. But what I am saying is that you don't need to wait for that to be okay and to feel whole. The idea of a soulmate or a twin flame, it's almost like you're saying you're not complete unless you have that other person. You can be 100% complete alone by yourself, just you, yourself, and me, myself, and I, I'll say it that way. I think that there's somebody out there for everyone and multiple people out there for everyone. And I don't mean multiple people at the same time. I mean, if it doesn't work out with one, there's always another. When one gets away, it's okay. That leaves the door open for someone else to come in. Stop looking for love, stop looking for it. Stop looking for a soulmate. Stop looking for a twin flame or some kind of other half. The world is huge and that soulmate might be on the other side of the world, the one you think is perfect for you. Keep in mind also that a soulmate or a twin flame isn't always the most positive experience. It can be very demanding and challenging and stressful. It can be scary and it can be anger provoking. It brings out lots of emotions and it causes you to really soul search. So you can find a lot more loving happiness with someone who's not your twin flame or your soulmate. Keep in mind also a soulmate can be someone not romantic. It can be a friend, it can be a sibling, it can be somebody that you really resonate with. You can be complete without a romantic relationship. Yes, they're great, yes, they're beautiful, but you don't need it. And people on Valentine's Day feel really lonely and sad and you don't, you never need to feel that way. Lots of love and light to all of you. Happy Valentine's Day. <laughs>